This is Checking the Diary. I'm going to say for Wednesday, October 7th, because I'm not convinced it'll get edited in time to put up. If it does, this is Checking the Diary for October 6th. <laughs> uh, wow, I'm so happy with how September wrapped up and thoroughly loving this October so far. There's a lot of creativity going on. Uh, there's a lot of murmurings about a October, which I guess I ruined <laughs> with yesterday's post on Patreon when I just willy nilly threw the idea of orgasms out there. Uh, man, you can't deny yourself for an entire month, can you? Well, it's just fitting that the next voice in the background session that I'm working on has a little snippet about denial in there. And I'm sure you've noticed that there is a doll trailer or teaser, if you like, that's out. Uh, it's basically a sex doll session, but I've left the word sex off because I don't know, it just seems a little crude to keep throwing that in the title, doesn't it? This one is for patrons only, but I did, um, mostly because my Patreon is basically full, I did also put it available as a purchase on SpokenByElswith.com. If you go there, you'll have to look at October 6th to find it, because I don't really want to maintain a storefront. <laughs> This is a fun hedonistic pleasure for me as well, and if I get all bogged down in admin, I will, um, hate it. So, uh, let's see. Oh, circles. Wow, wow, wow. I have enjoyed the response a lot. I really enjoyed hearing from people who found things that maybe they'd never considered before or maybe didn't feel safe in exploring. I've seen in a few of the personal uh, folders where people have added things in, either snippets in text or on their mood boards, vision boards, doodle boards, jam boards, whatever those things are called. I threw up a few other pictures on mine. Uh, if you don't have a personal folder or don't know what I'm talking about, uh, just ask me. And let's see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, I'm really waffling on whether or not to discuss this one. Um, oh, what the hell? We'll just go for it, right? I received the most um, unexpected <laughs> audio. Um, yeah, the most unexpected audio. And uh, it has made me uh, smile off and on. And I have to say, simply because I thought it was something else when I clicked on it, you actually got a blush out of me. And I don't normally blush so you know who you are because I've made the comment back to you about it so well done um, my dear Z and T you are ones who gave me a lot of feedback on circles and I appreciate it uh, I've had an interesting oops <laughs> happen with one of my with one of my uh, gentlemen who has a personal session. You see, sometimes, sometimes, um, Peter will take it upon himself to name sessions, and I really don't mind. He's editing them, and a lot of times my file names will be basically like, Peter, you must edit this by Wednesday, thank you. And that's it. Or that's the name of the project in Reaper that he has to, um, 
deal with. <laughs> so he usually, if it's a personal session, he puts what month it is and um, the person's name that I've put on it. But for this one, I was doing it as little um, vignettes of sorts, little snippets of shared daydreams. And I've done that with a few of you. Uh, so that probably sounds familiar, like files that can be shuffled. You can listen to one, you can rotate them through, you can randomize, whatever. Uh, it's kind of a fun way to either have a long session if you have time for it, or have the short one, or uh, I know for a few of you, you just let them repeat while you're sleeping. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, he renamed this snippet to something that didn't quite uh, mirror what was in it. You see, it was a session about cuckolding. Now, Peter likes cuckolding. That's like, okay, that's it. He's right up for that, right? It's like asking him if he wants pizza or tacos or, you know, to sit outside the door while I'm with another man. He's like, okay, sure, let's do that. Sounds good. Um, <laughs> to be fair, he's a man who thinks with his tummy a lot, so it probably ranks about the same as pizza night. Anyway, he renamed, well, named the cuck fantasy togetherness or together, something like that. Which made me think it was something different. So, this poor gentleman of mine who's been with me since almost the beginning, if not, um, who doesn't really have cuck holding as one of his fantasies, <laughs> got to experience it. So crazy careless of me, and I think that kind of sums up how September was. Um, I like it, it was fine, it's just there's so many ideas and things and sometimes with this back and forth of um, having somebody else do the editing and such, uh, yeah, it's kind of easy for that to sneak in uh, once in a while, but, but, I can assure you that I will stop using ridiculous um, names for projects and only use the name that I expect it to come back as. So uh, I hope you all are going, are having like this wonderful week so far. I know that uh, I've been talking about sex a lot on Patreon. Um, oh, it's just because it's chillier, right? <laughs> If you're going to be cold and you're going to find ways to warm up, they might as well be interesting ones. Uh, summertime is just, well, no, summertime is good for sex too, and so is winter. Spring is really good for getting out and hiking, just saying, um, but all the other months, yeah. Anyway, I hope again that you're all having a wonderful week. For those of you who do like sex doll play, uh, do listen to that session. Tell me if you enjoy it. It's stuff that I enjoy, so hopefully you do. I also have, oh, last thing. I do have an erasing triggers session that is going to come out. I will probably set it in with the foundation sessions that I'm slowly but surely organizing for Spoken by Ellsworth. Uh, I think it'll be well received, but there will be a few of you that I plan to send notes to and say, do not listen to this one. Mistress is allowed to do that, right? All right, enjoy the rest of your day. Get up to something good. And you know what? If you really, really, really want to do Locktober, go for it. If you want me to be your accountability buddy, you have to send proof that you're doing it. Bye for now.